back to my channel. I'm Bianca and I am a chef. I'm a TV show host, I'm a podcast host, but most importantly, I am the person that is gonna help you sync your diet and the food that you eat to your menstrual cycle. And this is in order to do away with heavy periods, painful periods, I mean cramps, your period going away, your period taking forever to come, all of those things can be drastically improved by cycle syncing. And I'm gonna teach you how to do that. But one of the things that comes up a lot when I talk to people about how I've synced my diet to my life and, you know, people ask me how I'm doing, um, and I tell them because I tell everybody because I'm obsessed, um, is can weight loss and cycle syncing go together? And it's interesting because cycle syncing, even though I call it the cycle syncing diet, it's not a diet. It's a lifestyle. It's a way that you live cyclically over 28 days, you know, every four weeks within a 28 day cycle, I cycle between my follicular phase, my ovulatory phase, my luteal phase, and my menstrual phase. And in those phases, I eat different foods to help me have a pain-free bleed. But more, more than that, it helps me to in, feel good in my body outside of my bleed as well. I don't get bloated. My skin doesn't break out. I don't get constipated. My stomach isn't weird. Like my period is just a time of the month where sure, I slow down because that's a part of it. It is just a part of honoring that spiritual side of it, but I'm not in pain, it's not taking me out. But that being said, one of the things that I have noticed over the last, I mean, almost a year of doing this consistently month over month is that people ask me if, you know, I've lost weight, you know, your skin looks great, you know, what are you doing? And I'll tell you right now, I use very affordable skincare. I don't do anything fancy as far as that is concerned. And I look this way because I feel like my hormones, my blood sugar, everything is so balanced and so aligned that the byproduct of it all was better skin, losing weight, being less bloated. It's not even that I think I lost weight. I think I'm just not bloated anymore like I used to be before. But one of the things I always encourage people to think of, and not just when they're cycle syncing, but when they're endeavoring to get healthy in any way, is to start to put the barometrics that you measure things by into feelings and not lookings, if that makes any sense. You know, weight loss is a looking, you know, snatching that waist, which we all want, because I mean, summer, I get it, um, is something that it's like how, you, how you're looking. Whereas how you're feeling is like, do, am I bloated right now? Do I eat this thing and have a reaction? Um, am I sleeping well? Am I, is my period painful? I mean, if you start to eat for anything, whether it's good digestion, whether it's happy hormones, whether it's for better skin, regardless of you know why the impetus is, focus on those metrics instead of weight loss. Because weight loss is a byproduct of all of that. Eating according to your menstrual cycle and looking at the full list of foods in each phase, you'll notice that it's whole foods. It's all food that has benefits to our body, fiber, protein, you know, carbohydrates. It's really like giving. That list is giving your body everything it needs. And so, I mean, just by virtue of the list alone, if you were eating things outside of that one that were maybe not so cycle supportive, and then you make this switch to cycle syncing, like, I'm not gonna tell you you're gonna lose weight, but it would make sense that you would if you were eating in a different way. So that's just like one of the things. But also in addition to cycle syncing, something that's really important and that is really coming more into focus for me, certainly as I am going down this path myself, is blood sugar balance. Um, cycle syncing is amazing. It has changed my life. It's changed my eczema. It's changed just like everything. I love cycle syncing. I mean, I feel like that's pretty clear. But when I married the cycle syncing diet and the foods and sort of that protocol with a protocol that also supports my blood sugar balance, that was when things like went to another level. Like we're talking, my period shows up and it's like, I have to look at the calendar and be like, oh yeah, that's coming. Because I don't have all of those like things that I used to think before were just like normal lead up to period, which was like that like really heavy uterus feeling, like feeling kind of like, not to be gross, but like jammy down there, you know, like I wasn't getting um, some of the negative side effects that were like 
reminding me that I was getting my period it would just come. And I think that has really been because of the combination with blood sugar balancing and also um, cycle syncing, because I do think that the two uh, mean so much because if your blood sugar is out of whack and insulin goes crazy, that spirals all other hormones, including, you know, our happy, healthy period hormones. So um, cycle syncing, of course, you're going to, you know, lose weight if you are eating completely different and you're focusing now on the fresh whole foods that you see on that list. Weight loss, you know, just I think again, by virtue of how it works, um, will probably be the byproduct of that. But something to also consider when you are working um, into a cyclical life and a cyclical diet is also balancing your blood sugar. Because for me, that was kind of like the missing like piece, like everything was falling into line, but there were just like a few shifts and that was one of them. I'm going to talk about this so much more in another video because it deserves its own. But just to wrap up what we're talking about in this one, you know, if you are doing cycle syncing to lose weight, I want you to divorce yourself from that mindset and that line of thinking and instead start to think of all the things that you're going to get. You're, you might lose weight, but what you're going to gain is your life back your comfortability in your body back. You're going to gain, you know, being able to feel confident, comfortable, and like not in pain in your body. All those things you gain. And if you lose some weight, amazing, but take that out of the equation because that's just like a byproduct, just like a happy accident as it were. So I hope that helps. Um, and like I said, I'm going to be talking so much more about blood sugar because I think it's so important. And I've really discovered that marrying cycle syncing and blood sugar balance has been such a godsend for me. So I will see you next time. I'm Bianca. I am the chef that is helping you sync your diet to your cycle and have happy pain-free periods. I'll see you next time.